Today, the Bryan College Station Police and Fire Departments went out to Tonkaway Ranch to get more familiarized on trauma when they're out in the field. That's right. It's the type of scene that they hope to avoid, but also need to be ready for to keep the community safe. Today's teachers, medical doctors from Caprock ER and St. Joseph Hospital, KXHD News reporter Shada Nazifor takes us to the ranch. The first responders to any accident are the ones who will save your life and keep you stable. That's what the Bryan College Station Police and Fire Department were reviewing today, helping them to act fast. Our deputies and the first responders are out there at risk all the time. And, and if we run into a situation that uh, has some trauma or some medical needs, uh, it's important that we know how to respond to those. While everyone at the seminar already knew this information, it's always a good idea to get a refresher. Constantly brushing up, um, you forget things, you know, and especially if you're not constantly training on it, uh, it's easy to forget small small aspects of it that are, that are really important. After an intense education course this morning, the Ryan College Station Police and Fire Department decided to come out and have some friendly competition. They were able to let off some steam by flying in a helicopter, shoot some skeet, and everyone's favorite, the machine gun. I want these folks to have the best tools and education they can, and this is an opportunity for them to get educated, learn, and have a little fun, which they deserve because they're there for us when we need them. When it comes down to serving our community, it's important that we're trained and prepared and, and ready to serve. Serving the community by keeping up with their trauma skills. In College Station, Shada Nazifpour, KX HD News. Now, the owner of Tonkaway Ranch said he hopes this will become an annual event. All the first responders seem to be very happy with the lessons and seem to enjoy themselves. Well, time now.